What's up, watch fam? Uh, Daily wristwatch check followers and subscribers here. Uh, this is GCR coming to you live. Uh, taking a taking a quick um, lunch break. I'm working from home today, and I received a package that I'm really excited about. So, I uh, wanted to share it with all of you. Uh, anyway, wristwatch check. I'm wearing my uh, my new G-Shock. Um, this all stainless, shiny, bling bling. Um, G-Shock. I got this from WatchGauge.com. So guys, definitely check out WatchGauge.com. My good buddy John Keel's company. Uh, let's see if I can do a quick uh, zoom job there. I'm not very good at this, so <laughs> bear with me. Sorry for the hairy wrist, but I am a Mediterranean, half Mediterranean man. So our uh, arm hair grows like uh, basil in the backyard or uh, mint or weeds. <laughs> So, I don't really do a trim. Sometimes. I actually, I may do a little trim job for the watch that I'm about to put on. So, uh, show you guys soon. Anyway, the ugly mug. <laughs> anyway, so let's do a, I don't know if you guys could see this uh, box. You may know already what it is based on the shape. Um, let's do a drum roll. I'm sorry, I don't have the whole camera set up where I can... Uh, Hover the damn thing over um, my, uh, you know, the example that I'm, you know, that I'm about to open. But anyway, we'll get to that at some point. You know, definitely planning on doing more uh, uh, wristwatch uh, reviews. Um, I don't have a fancy knife with me. I am using a regular steak knife to open the box. So I already kind of did that. Just wanted to share with you guys. It is a German knife. I don't remember the name of the company, but it's not one of the one of those fancy knives. I do have a couple Opinels, but. Uh, just use this because I'm so excited to open this box with you guys. So drum roll. What can it be? Take guesses below, please. Oh. Going to be uh, playing with this later. All right. So. Doesn't say what it is yet. It's, you know, it's a pretty popular watch. A lot of people have been talking about it, so... Let's see what it is. Oh. Flip it around here. What do you guys think it is? Should I show you the box? Oh. Anyway. Look at that. What does that say, everybody? So let me switch camera view because now you don't have to see my ugly mug. And uh, you could see the watch once I open it. See, I just dropped that. So, yeah, now I can kind of hover it over. So, I'm going to switch camera views. What's up, Ace? Nikki, how you doing, Nick? Nick the Greek. And voila. The Q reissue. Yes, this watch, slut. Pulled the trigger on this. Luckily, I was one of the lucky few who was able to pull it off before it sold out. Shout out to my good friend Ariel, who did a review on Watch With Us. Uh, check it out. He did a review of this watch. So I probably won't be doing a review, but I'm doing an unboxing. So still got the plastic nice and fresh. Straight from Timex. Let's take that sticker off. What do you guys think? I think this is a keeper. Now, one thing that Ariel um, mentioned, <laughs> and I am a hairy-wristed gentleman myself, probably more than him. He said I may need to, I may need to manscape <laughs> my wrist. I did that once, and it looked terrible, and I didn't do a good job because of this bracelet. This bracelet is a hair catcher, so. I don't know. But anyway, I have a Pepsi GMT Rolex. So now I have a Pepsi Q uh, Rolex. I'm um, Rolex Timex. <laughs> uh, and I'm, you know, I'm ecstatic. I mean, as soon as I saw it on the website, um, I wanted one. Never knew the watch. I was born 1981. So I never knew the watch. Um, the original, I think the original came out in the 70s. But uh, loving it. It's really nice. Should we get it on the wrist? I mean, I have to size it, and I'm not going to fiddle with that right now. But 
You'll see some wristwatch checks of this baby soon. Let's let's lay it on the wrist at least. So sorry for the camera movement, gents and ladies. So there it is on the hairy wrist. That is a sweet looking piece. Let me tell you, man, this bracelet quality for a hundred and something dollars. That is a beauty. So this is, wow, this does not look like a watch that's less than $200. I mean, I know it's quartz. I mean, if this was, you know, I know they wanted to do the reissue and keep it as original as possible. But, uh, you know, they could have, if they drop an automatic of this, Timex uh, can raise the price a little bit more. And, uh, you know, they'll, they'll have themselves a, a real bestseller. This is a beauty. Anyway, guys, it's a really quick video. Ariel already did a uh, review on the Watch With Us channel, so check that out if you want to get into more detail on the watch. I'm not going to be doing that. I just wanted to do the unboxing because I thought it'd be fun. Uh, and it's, uh, it's a beauty. So I was wearing that. I put this baby on now and enjoying it. So guys, thanks for checking uh, the video out. It's a quick, fun video, just a quick unboxing. Have a great rest of the day to everybody. And, uh, you know, we'll see each other soon. Cheers. So as I mentioned, guys, please check out the Watch With Us channel uh, down below. Subscribe if you like the video. And uh, please share with your friends. Uh, a lot more great content coming from myself and the rest of the contributors. It's an exciting project we have going on. And we want more people to, to get to know it. So please, as I mentioned, subscribe to the YouTube below. And then definitely subscribe on the Facebook and Instagram at Watch With Us. Have a great day, everybody.